our hearts beat to the city streets we begin to feel the fire we rise like tall buildings as the chemicals they take us higher the night's young and it's just begun as she puts her hand in mine Hey guys, hope all are doing good. Welcome back to my channel. As the festive season approaches, many of us start by decluttering our homes. This process can feel overwhelming. But in this video, I will share some simple tips to help you keep your space clutter free. A decluttered home makes it easier to find and access item and also it saves time. Instead of rushing at once, establish a cleaning routine, create a daily, weekly and monthly cleaning schedule to keep tasks manageable. At first, take out everything you want to organize, let go of the things which are old and no more needed. I am sorting the items into two groups, one is cushion covers that are occasionally used, another one is daily used item. I will wipe the cabinet to remove dust before starting arranging the things. In the first cabinet, I am storing all the cushion covers that I use for my living room. Here, as you can see, I have separated occasionally used cushion covers and daily used one. In the second cabinet, I am storing table runners which I use for my center table. Along with it, I am adding the small trays to store other things. In this box, I have added all the visiting cards. And in the corner, I am utilizing the space to add the small glass bowl to store the keys. I will keep new batteries in the tray so that they are easily accessible whenever needed. In other tray, I am adding TV remotes. In this first cabinet, I am adding some tassels which are also part of living room decor. We often accumulate many items and lose track of bills. Searching for them later, instead, we should make a habit to store all our bills in one designated place. When we store the things in a proper way, life becomes easier. 
since we were craving a tasty snack i decided to make pav bhaji i am making it in a simple way and i thought of sharing the recipe with you all i have taken aloo beans and carrot i am dicing them into bigger pieces and i am going to pressure cook them here i am adding hot water to make the process bit quicker By the time it cools down, I thought of organizing my medicines. Organizing medicines effectively is important for safety and accessibility. Periodically, check and reorganize your medications to ensure everything is up to date. And also, it's important to check and discard any expiry medications in a proper way. Some of the medicines may not have date specification on it. Make sure you write the date on it so that the medicines can be used appropriately. Make sure to separate the daily use medicines and store them in a appropriate place. Here I'm chopping onions for pav bhaji. I have taken butter to which I am adding ginger garlic paste. To this now I am adding onions. To this now I am adding chili powder and pav bhaji masala. I have taken Everest pav bhaji masala here. Now I am adding tomatoes. They will also add tomato puree, but I prefer it to be like this. I will add salt and let it cook. Now to this, I am adding cooked and smashed vegetables. Now the bhaji is ready. When you gather all your jewelry in one place it can be hard to access To make it easier separate your daily use jewelry into a small box for quick access In this small box I'm adding daily used kada and some black oxide jewelry and small earrings These small boxes can be very handy to store as well as to carry. Now it's time to savor our pav bhaji. With this bhaji, I'm adding butter fried pav. To bhaji, I'm adding butter, raw onion and lemon. After savoring pav bhaji, I was planning to organize my dressing table. Our dressing tables can often feel messy due to regular use. A great way to keep them organized is by using different pouches for storage. Here I am using this small pouch to store all my nail paints. In another pouch, I'm adding all the blush and mineral powder used for makeup. This kind of storage can be very helpful to avoid visual clutter. 
Not only that, these small pouches work wonder by storing many items in a small space. And also, whenever required, these pouches can be used for travel as well. One of the main key mantra to keep your home clutter free is make the clear differences between your wants and needs and try to avoid unnecessary purchases. This is all for today. I hope these simple tips will be helpful for you. Thanks for being till the end. Please do like, share and subscribe to my channel.